Hi guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Boosters Sports Card Collecting. Today I'm going to uh, have another PSA show off reveal. Not of the cards that I received, but cards I'm going to ship out or actually take to work. Um, so I'll show you those in a second. But I do want to show you the three cards in the background. I'm actually are for sale. If you have anybody's interested, let me know. Uh, it is a 2022 Chronicles Jeremy Pena rookie card, Revolution Cubic. PSA 9 and it's numbered to 25 Pulled this in a blaster box from Ethan right there number 16 at 25 Rich really cool card uh, We're looking for a hundred bucks or best offer on that I uh, got this When I pulled this from a break with B max breaks. This is a 2021 Bowman's best Akil Badu best of 21 atomic refractor auto got a 10 and a 10 this was a redemption, my first redemption that I've gotten, and I got back. So, it's number to 25. It is number 11 of 25. And I'm looking for 125 or best offer on that. And then, this last one, I recently pulled out of a blaster from Ethan for Bowman. And it is a 2023 Bowman Troy Johnson Green Shimmer Refractor, number to 99, number 97 of 99. And it got a 1010. Looking for 150 or best offer for this card. This is one of this gentleman's best uh, baseball cards. So, and <clears throat> after all that, let me show you what I'm going to actually send in the PSA. This is a 2020 Spectra Nextra uh, patch of Justin Herbert rookie card. With the uh, silver or refractor on it. It's numbered to 199. It's. Mm, let's see here. Come on, focus. There you go. It's number 70 of 199. So. But it's a patch card, so probably PSA 9, but we'll see. Got this uh, 2018 Bowman rookie card of Shohei Otani. Looks pretty good. Hoping for a 10, but we'll probably see a 9. Let's see. This one is a hmm, Luca 2017 or 2018. And it's a, it's a Luca rookie performance from Panini. It doesn't say what type of Panini, right? Uh, Stratus basketball. Luca Doncic rookie card. Pretty sweet. Definitely good to have slabbed up, I would think. This is a 2020 score Joe Burrow rookie card and it's either a gold or a yellow I don't remember which one but uh, that's cool I have his uh, regular and I have a black one of his but it came back a PSA 8 I have this 2021 opening day short print or super short print I can't remember which one of Nolan Arenado Super off-centered, I know, but we'll see. Probably come back in eight, I assume. It's in good condition, really sharp corners, just off-centered. Now this one, I don't really know this guy very much. I'm not a Formula One fan, but this is number two of five. So, yeah, I thought this would be good to go in. Lurum Zenderdale. Future Stars, and this is number two of five. Lerman... Zenderell. Mm. Right there. Two of five. So, we'll see what that comes back. It'd be nice to see that come back at Jim at 10. Uh, this is the car that everybody's chasing right now, but it's just the base from Bowman University. It's a Bowman first of Victor Ramavanya. However, you say his last name, I always mess it up. But he's the big guy from, that went to the Spurs from France, I believe, is where he's from. But hoping the gin meant this, but we'll see. I think it has a dimple on it, but still a card I think worth sending in. Uh, this is a 2020 Top Stadium Club Chrome Refractor of Shohei Otani. I'm definitely hoping for a 10 on this. 
Next one is a 2019 Chrome All-Star Game of Nolan Arenado. Same thing, hoping for a nice gem mint. We'll see. Got this. This is a 2021, I think, of a baseball card day. It's a Nolan Arenado. Maybe it was 2020. I don't know. I think it's 2020 actually. And this one is a Tops Now Summer Camp Nolan Arenado with the mask. This one I'm hoping to gem up. And the last card in my submission pulled this out of a blaster that I got out of Ethan's Patreon last uh, time. Open a Series 3. Uh, I'm sorry, Series 2, 2023 Tops, and got a Corbin Carroll rookie card, so since he's doing so good, figured I'll send that one in. We'll prefer a 10, probably get a 9, but even so. So that's my submission. Let me know in the comments down below what you think, of whether they're good or bad, or what you think about my grading predictions. And if anybody's interested in the cards that I showed, please leave a comment. I'll always get back to you as soon as you can, as I can. Alright guys, so like, subscribe if you haven't, and as always, peace.